Hey, what's up, YouTube? All right, back with a video. It's been a while. I know that. Sorry, I haven't made a video. It's crazy. Get get more busy with life and other stuff and doing things, and it's crazy. You guys know how it is. Well, believe me, I've been thinking about making videos. I got all these ideas down. I'm writing my pad. So right now, I'm just gonna write a little update how everybody's doing, and they're all pretty good. Uh, haven't really taken them out much. I, I guess busy with life and stuff, so um, that's that's the one of the males I have, and this is my other male, and yeah, they're all doing pretty good. I feed these guys like every seven days, and look at these, they're beautiful. These are normal ball pythons, normal. This one's head albino, and look, these are, these are just beautiful animals, look at them, look at them, and they're tame, these guys are tame. I think it's because they know me. So probably that's what it is, but yeah, I, could, I put them up here, they'll hang up here for a little while, uh, just to make sure they don't fall, and they're pretty good about it, let's see now, 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 I'm a Penelope, the new carpet python that I bought, she is like, she just hangs out, she comes out, now she's like, used to her hide, you know, because she just hangs out now, she sticks, I could stick my hand in there, I'm going to stick my hand in there right now and bring her out. kind of like a oh. Okay. Yeah. What's the matter, Penelope? She wanna come out. Okay, let me bring her out. Okay, there she is. There she is. I'm sorry. And like I said, she is like a sweetheart. Look at her. Check her out. I could pick her up now. Remember when I first got her, she, she bit me? <laughs> you guys watched that video back then? But look at her now. She put a little weight on, so that's nice. I noticed that the carpet pythons don't eat as much as the ball pythons. Like, she'll eat like once every three weeks. Spot will eat like once every month, month and a half. But look at her, she's like a sweetheart. Yeah, she's hissing and stuff, they do that. But she is a sweetheart. They are known to be face biters, so. But these guys are pretty nice. They've never, except Spot, uh, about maybe about a couple of months ago, I opened Spot's tank and I haven't opened it like in months he's been in there. And I was opening it to clean it. So I took the, I took the lid off. And when I when when I moved the lid off, I saw Spot. He like, jumped up, his jaw was like right past my face. I don't. I guess he was in a bad mood. I don't know. Maybe he was pissed. That I haven't taken him out in a while. So since then, I haven't taken him out and hanging him up on here with the other with, with Penelope. I'll give him their time. They, they hang up there for a while. I'm gonna take him out right now. Let me put Penelope back. And I'm watching these guys because I don't want them to fall. So let me make sure they're going to be alright. Maybe I'll put them guys back too. But they're not going to want to go back. But they're a lot easier to get off of here than Spot and Penelope. Uh-oh. Now, my bird is in that up there. She's covered. My, I have a Kanye or Nande. So I don't want them or Penelope to get too close to there. She's going to smell her. You know, but I have a Nandy there. I usually put her out during the day. She'll go out in the hall. But yeah, you guys take a nice close look at Penelope. Look at her. Look at that. And she's a sweetheart. Look at her. Remember how jumpy she was when I first got her? She was always like in striking pose. But look at her now. I can just pick her up. I stick my hand right in the tank and grab her. You know? She's like a sweetheart. I really like her. She's a... She's awesome. She's an awesome snake. Now these guys don't want to come down, but I'm going to try and get them down, or maybe I should just give the girl some outside time too, and maybe that's what I'll do. I'm going to give the female some outside time. Uh-oh. That's what I didn't want to happen, but he's all right, so maybe I won't give her no outside time. Maybe I'll just put them away. Okay. Go in here. Uh -oh. All right, all right, all right. Let's, 
that wasn't that much of a fall, well, you know. Snakes are pretty hardy, you know. Uh oh, she's pissed though now. Now she's pissed. Hopefully, don't bite me. But well, she's pissed that she fell now. Oh boy. Now let me just get these guys back. This guy fell. He was in the bottom tank. So what I like to do is I like to switch around their tanks. I'll switch them around, and I think it gives them a little more. I mean, kind of occupies them. They're in a new, they're in a new tank, and they're moving around and exploring. So I think it kind of um, helps them stimulate their mind and stuff. Uh, she looks like she wants to come out, so maybe I'll take her out. python female uh, Juliet I sometimes call them Romeo and Juliet Bonnie and Clyde they got a color I always change their names but she is pretty thick you know what I'm gonna do I have another video that I want to do a weigh-in so I'm gonna weigh these guys I'm trying to do that later on or tomorrow I'll do a weigh-in video uh, I'm gonna put her up there so they don't get in each other's way even though they're not like enemies or nothing like that but I just, you know, you never know. Okay. Let me check her out. Yeah, she looks pretty good. She's hanging there. That's the male head albino. And that's the female normal. Uh, I don't know. I hope she's head albino. She has those nice white stripes along the side. You know, she looks kind of like head albine. Who knows? But find out when I breed her. Because I do want to breed them and just see what happens. You know, maybe, you know, I can breed them. And, you know, especially for the experience. And to know that I can accomplish that would be cool. So let's see what happens. But they all need a little bit more weight before that could happen. And, yeah, and that's everybody. Well, not everybody. Let me take out, I should take out Spot. Let me take out Spot. I could put Penelope up here. And then I could take out Spot. You guys haven't seen Spot in a while. And Spot's always pretty cool. Oh, sorry Spot. I kind of woke him up there. And like I said, Spot's pretty cool. I could just reach in there and just take him out. He's pretty cool. So yeah, here's Spot. You know? Make sure they're not going for the bird. Okay, Penelope's just going off. And here's Spot. You guys remember Spot, right? He's getting nice and he's pretty heavy. He hasn't eaten over a month. About a month now. Going over going into just over a month. But I'm not worried because I'm uh like I said, he feels thick, he feels strong, and I'm pretty sure he'll eat soon. He does that. He used to do it a lot when I first got him. I thought it was just stress. But then I noticed he does it every year. He'll go off for a little while, then he'll go back on. So yeah, so that's about it. You know, Savannah's down there, but I'm not going to take her out. She's sleeping, and uh-oh. I don't want to just take her out because they might think she's food or she might think they're food and who knows could have a disaster so but yeah this is it everybody's hanging you know I, uh, that's I guess that's about it for my collection and my turtle I gotta get a tank he's in that tub right now she's in that tub but um, uh, she's okay in there once it gets warm I'll put it in the backyard like I did last year I do every year so I'm um, uh, Yep, that's about it. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed the video. And here's everybody. Okay, leave a comment. Thank you.